Lynch Papers was a, a consultant, his name Willie Lynch. He was hired by a slave owner in 1712. The slave owner was pissed off because his slaves were not working very efficiently and he'd paid damn good money for them and wanted some efficient work. So he hired a consultant to figure out what to do to make them work better. So in 1712, Willie Lynch comes out with this theory. The theory was that you need to create a system where these people down here are doing whatever it is they're doing so that the only person they can trust is the slave owner. That's a tall order. So when going into it a little bit more, Willie Lynch says that you need to pit the slaves against each other. Whether it's house slaves versus field slaves, light skin, dark skin, adults, children, men, women, this plantation versus that plantation. If you can pit them against each other, they'll be so busy trying to figure out where they measure up down here that not only will they trust the slave owner, but they'll even thank him. All right, I'll give it a whirl, says the slave owner. Willie Lynch suggested that this would last for about 300 years. It's 2010, so probably with the Mayans' approval, we have two years left to stop doing this. The reason why I think this is so important is because we are pitting ourselves against people all the time. There's athletes versus non-athletes. Within athletes, there's all the different teams, men's sports versus women's sports, and then the sports within those categories. There's Greek life, fraternities and sororities versus independence. And then within Greeks, there's all the different fraternities and all the different sororities. There's hard sciences versus soft sciences. This campus versus the campus across the street. There's financial aid receiving students and people who write checks for tuition. There's men versus women. There's straight people versus everybody else. In everybody else, there's gay versus lesbian and gay and lesbian versus bisexual. There's Christian versus everybody else. And Christian in this context typically means Protestant based. So when you get over here to everybody else, the Catholics seem to have a leg up and then it's everybody else. If we can stop pitting ourselves against each other, I believe we will have already dismantled oppression. The system that is currently in place is in place because we're letting it stay there. We're so busy fighting against each other that we're thanking the system for putting it in place. James Larkin, who's a famous union activist in Ireland, has a really powerful quote that I say to myself over and over and over again every day. And that is, the great appear great because we are on our knees. Let's rise. Mm -hmm.